And in this video, what I'm going to do is give you a, another update on my Drosera seeds. I can't say it's my ping seeds because in my previous videos, my ping seeds turned into Droseras. So here is the first container. Just take the lid off. Get right there in the middle. Oh, not so close. Let me just kind of raise her up. I can see that there is a couple sections that has Droseras. Not as many um, as I would like, but they're there. And let me just kind of point them out for you. Okay. So here's the biggest one that I see. It's right here. This is the biggest Drosera that is growing. It's pretty cool. It's got the long tentacles. And at the end, here are some more, just a couple more Droseras. And then here is, I wanna say like three or four different other little babies uh, that are continually growing. So right there. These have definitely been a little sporadic, not as many um, from the original kind of like seed bunch. I believe, when did I start growing these? Oh, I started growing these in January. So I grew them in January, now it's uh, April, it's April 20th. So that's, you know, a good four months. So that's four months worth of growth on this one. So here, let me just kinda, I'll cover this one back up. So that's for that update. And then here is the second update that I have. Let's see here. I got these from a, um, a Facebook group that I'm in, uh, Carnivorous Plants, and someone, one of the members was offering up Drosera seeds, like 100 for like 650, and I just kind of jumped on it. This is the first time that I've been, that I've opened this since it's, since the germination uh, video that I put together. So let us see. Uh, come on. Okay, here we go. Let's go for the reveal. Oh, let's let this kind of like drain, drip. Whoa. Oh my holy lord. Check this out. So this is Drosera natalensis. Look at all those babies. Look at all those pups. There are a lot, and I can tell you this is more than a hundred. This is a lot. Look at all of them. Let me just kind of, I'm going to just bring this up really close to the camera. Let me make sure that it gets some kind of focus so you can see it. Maybe you just, oh, the way I'm holding it. Oh, look at that. That is so cool. I can tell that these Droseras are slightly different than the first batch because the first batch, the, the stems, the tentacles, uh, they're not as big or not as long. Oh, these are so cool. Look at these suckers grow. There is a lot of them. And I started growing these uh, a month ago. So these were back in March. Now, like I said, this is April. And I just wanted to give you a quick update on the progress of uh, both of these seeds. They're still growing. As you can tell, this container right here, this, this is like a, a gold mine worth of uh, Drosera's. I'm gonna just, um, one, I don't know what exactly what I'm gonna do with them. And then two, I'm just gonna let them grow, just continually grow, because I don't think I can kind of touch them right now at this point. They are very small and tiny. I don't know exactly what to do with them. So just wanted to provide you with a quick update. Thank you for watching my video. And, and until the next updates, thank you. Have a great day.